welcome back and I'm doing another review for you guys I actually got a message um, from one of my subscribers and she was asking you know if my channel is just gonna be on project plans and stuff and I told her no reviews are coming so I actually have two other reviews I need to edit um, because I wanted to show a little demonstration on products so it's like a piece of get ready with me so until I can do that get ready with me to go with that review yeah, those two items are a little on hold. So, I am using this Wet n Wild um, cover of cream foundation, and I want to share my thoughts on it. I initially thought I had a review on it, and I checked, and I realized I didn't. I have the shade here with me in medium, and quite frankly, I think tan is my color. Now, I did get a little darker for the last couple of days because I was at the beach and stuff like that. Um, but I don't like this foundation. I remember loving it because I had like four of this foundation. I've used up two already and you get um, one fluid ounce but it really, you end up building because it says that it's a cover all. I think it's between a light and medium so that you have to put almost two layers in it. So generally when a foundation, a one ounce foundation lasts me three months, this goes like one and a half. So. I tried it in medium. I think tan is may maybe most likely my color because I have to warm up my skin with this. Um, but I don't like it now. I find that it melts on my skin and I have to, if I don't use a really great powder to set it, it's going to just completely disappear. So it claims that it's all day wear. No, and you definitely need to use a good primer. Now, I'm not using a pore filling primer, and you can actually see through my skin. So that's I think, something with it. It's medium to full coverage. I think it's light to medium, and not medium to full coverage. Lightweight, satin, matte finish. It is lightweight. It's more of a satin, not a matte finish. I'm not noticing that. They say there's a Visibrite complexion, reduces the appearance of wrinkles, and rejuvenates skin. I don't know about the wrinkles, but my face does feel a bit hydrated so I don't think it dries out the moisture and my face has some full coverage foundation that's pretty much what it claims um, I had like it now I don't because I really need a full medium to full coverage foundation so if you want a light medium coverage um, you can check this out it's very inexpensive it's $3.99 US dollars it's available in most um, drug stores like Walmart Target it's available online generally lots of beauty supply stores carry these and um, you can get on eBay Amazon that kind of stuff I think if you I don't think they have a really nice range of colors so that it's very hard to match and I personally would not go on to purchase this even though it's so inexpensive I think I will spend my money and get like um, what's it three and one cover goes three and one or the l'oreal is a little more pricey but i think i'll put up my money and get that as again going back with this the elf um acne fighting foundation is quite nice i actually prefer that over this and it's give and take i think that's like six dollars this is four i'll go for that um but i won't repurchase this i'm not sure if i have any more in my collection but i'll definitely have to use them up have it a while but I'll give this like a three out of five and that's only in people have um like if you want a medium to light there's almost like a BB cream consistency if you have oily combo skin like I do then this is really not for you if you have dry combo then you can try this I think it's actually gonna work for you and if you are dry and combo skin but oily combo this definitely doesn't work for you and if you're going to use this get a really mattifying powder that's medium coverage so that it can you can build it up like you know to what i have here other than that you're gonna definitely look like it's a bb cream you're wearing so that's my thoughts on this if you have this product of use it let me know what you think about it but that's just my thoughts hope you guys enjoyed this little chat review on this product and stay tuned for more videos on this channel